What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of my Pokemon Y Egglock. In this episode we are going to be um, awakening I guess the legendary Pokemon Eveltal. So I guess let's get on I got Godzilla out front because I know it resists its um, signature move Oblivion Wing which is obviously going to restore health points to it which is not great. Um, <laughs> so we're going to get going slowly towards the button. <gasps> what is it? Hence, enter super aw super awesome cinematic cutscene with my red boots, <laughs> my brown trousers, and my orange top, and my stuff, yeah. Oh, da, 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 it's gonna awaken! <sighs> I love how this. Ah, oh, such an awesome scene! Best. Or what could be even the best scene in a Pokemon game because of how awesome it is, especially in 3D. Da, da, da. And the music as well! Oh, there he is. Or, oh, I guess he. Yeah, it's only as a girl. I don't care. If there's an agenda. I'm calling him a he. Eveltal has arrived! Bum, 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 bum. Oh, shit. Damn! <laughs> oh, my lord. It's so awesome with the red. Ah! So awesome, Eveltal. You're just. Ah. Amazing. Bum, 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 bum. And we go straight into the battle, which is awesome. Oh, yeah, let's get this shit going. And the fucking background thing about it, too. Oh, my God. I love this uh, part of the game. It's awesome. Dark Aura is going to power up Dark Timbers, I'm pretty sure. So I can go for Crunch. I can go for Earthquake or Dragon Claw. I think Dragon Claw. I, think dra I don't want to go for the Ice Fang in case it doesn't. It kills it like in one. Oh, shit. Damn. Definitely going to snap you after this. Okay. So, yeah, it's so you have a dark pulse. Brilliant. Okay. Napion, you're up. You're up, Napion, because it resists dark taboos, and that's what we need right now. Plus, Napion is, is a physical beast, so that's good. And Evil is also a physical attacker, I'm pretty sure, even though it knows dark pulse. Snarl is going to reduce my special attack, I'm pretty sure, as well as doing some damage. Yeah, my special attack. I don't care about special attack, though, because Napion is physical. So, we have the bite, it's going to do nothing. Oblivion Wing, though, is what I was afraid of, that's why I sent Godzilla in. Ah. Okay, it did some damage, not a huge amount. It's going to heal up some of the damage we did to it. Yeah, majority of it, actually. <laughs> Go for a bite. Wow, there's a huge Jaws. What the hell? <laughs> that's a crit as well, oh my lord. Go for the Wish again, because obviously we're going to get lower health here. Oh, damn, this is a, this is a hard battle. don't want to lose any Pokemon, really, do I? Oh, he felt just been a twat, though. Okay, we'll wish and heal up, and then I guess we can go for the last resort since it's not resisted. Whereas bite is, and it's plus plus a higher base power. We don't get stabbed from it, but it's a higher base power, so that's the best thing. It's gonna go for the disable, but we protect ourselves, so it's good. Um, wouldn't want to disable anything else, really, would we? <laughs> Let's go for the last resort. It's faster, so there's a disable. It's gonna disable our protect, which really sucks because we can't use wish protect for a bit. Last resort. It's gonna do mediocre damage. It's not. It's not too bad. Go for the last resort again. The stable failed, haha! -ha! Because you can't disable more than one move at once. Go for another of these. I think that another one's gonna be fine because it's not gonna kill it. So it's going for the disable again, really? What the hell? What the hell? Shouldn't kill it. Nope, didn't kill it. Okay, I'm going straight for the Pokeballs now. Let's do it. As usual for me, I want it in a normal Pokeball because that's just how I am, guys. So I guess we'll try for it, shall we? Okay, let's do it. One, two. Damn it! I think it has, this thing has a lower catch rate anyway, because of the fact you actually have to catch it. You can't like, go through it without catching it, so they've purposely given it a slightly higher, or higher catch rate rather than not lower. Higher catch rate than uh, than most legendaries, because obviously you have to catch it. So if they made it really hard to catch, then someone didn't have any decent Pokeballs there, but yeah. Didn't even go in the first one that time. Come on, Snarl again, please. Oblivion Wing, please not Oblivion Wing. Because it's powerful, does decent damage to us, and... It also heals your health points up. Arr! Okay, I'm gonna have to go for a wish now, protect, because obviously another blue wing is gonna take us down to red health. Uh hopefully not kill us now. <laughs> but yeah, okay, it's gonna be about 40 damage each time, 40, 50 damage, which isn't too bad, but still. Uh go for a, a wish, then go for a protect, then go for a last resort. And that should put down to red health again. Protect it. It's hopefully it goes for the loads of the sables again, because that'd be nice. <laughs> Um, we just got to stall it out pretty much, that's what we got to do, stall out its PP until it doesn't have any Oblivion Wings left and we'll be fine. This is our last resort though, which is a, it's a shame. Which 
means we haven't got our powerful attack still, we just left with bite. Okay, so it's got so it's got more health points than last time, which, which sucks. So I guess we go for the Pokeball again. Try and catch it. I could make it easier on me myself and go for an Ultra Ball, but I want the Pokeball. One. Two. Damn it, it's always on the second, third one. It goes on the first one sometimes. <laughs> snarl again, I'm fine with a snarl to be honest. How much people does Oblivion Wing have? Let me just check my phone. Because you know, if you, I use my phone for everything. Uh, no, not fight, please. Please, no fight. No ball. Okay. Come on, ball. Go. Oblivion wing. One. Damn it. Second time, that one. Don't go for Oblivion wing, please. Ah, oh, why'd you do this? <laughs> why you do this, Ivatil? Why you do this? Damn, that did 110 damage down to 68. That's 2, that's 42. So we should be able to survive another one. So I'm safe to go for a Wish Protect. Uh, bah, 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 bah. It's going to go for another Oblivion Wing. Urgh. I don't get how it restores health points either. Because it's, it's a wing. Like, how, where, when, how, like, I, I, I don't know. Anyway, too bad it sucks we're slower. Because obviously otherwise we could, you know, get some stuff off. But nope. Then we have to Protect. And we'll just get my health points healed up and I go, go for a wish straight away. I'm not going to be able to go for the capture again. Because obviously he's on getting low, more health. He's back to half health again. Urgh, so annoying. But yeah, I'll go for another wish again. Oblivion Wing has 10 PP. So yeah, that's good. He's going to run out soon. Protect was disabled. So I can't actually use Protect next turn. But at least he didn't attack me this turn. If he attacked me and I couldn't use Protect next turn, then we'd be in trouble. But it means I can just go for a clean... Bite this turn, I guess. Uh, then you have the Dark Pulse, which is, I think they might have run out of Oblivion Wing now, which is good. Um, not sure. Bite is going to do almost nothing, but we yes, would have to stall it out like that. Wish is going to come true, back to almost full, pretty much full health points, yeah. Uh, if he's run out of Oblivion Wing, we'll be fine. Yeah, it looks like he has. I'm not sure, I wasn't keeping count of how many he's used, but it looks like he's then run out, which is nice. Special Attack's fallen again, not like he was shit though. Bite in again. Two or three more bites, we might be good. Uh, might have to use a wish at some point. No, he's not. not as, he's got another one. Okay. So we can survive another of those, but I might go for a wish next turn. And uh, do that. Bite's gonna. Yeah. It's gonna take like two bites to get rid of every Oblivion Wing, pretty much. That was a crit as well. There we are. Okay, so Protect's no longer disabled, so I can go for a wish again. It's gonna go for another Oblivion Wing. Brilliant. <laughs> uh, okay, and then we can go for a wish and then Protect. Uh, I mean. Yeah, if we use a Wish Protect, which is a total PP of 20, we should be able to outstall easily. And then we just go for the Bites. That's the Wish done, now for the Protect. There we are. Noise, noise, not even bad. A Dark Pulse that time, and we get yeah, back up to almost full. I don't know if I'm going to go for another Wish straight away, or, or I'll go for a Bite. No, i go for a Bite rather than a Wish. Okay, he's on to Snarl again, so he may have now run out of PP. I'm not sure. Hmm, our special attack's almost gonna be like minus six. <laughs> okay, right. Bite again. Sable, it's gonna save my bite, really? I have no attacks now. Or have I have to wish and then protect. Okay, I'll protect once, then I wish and then I protect. Because I, I didn't protect earlier when I used the wish, so. Dark pulse, okay. Now I go for the wish, <laughs> now I go for the protect. Oh, he's got oblivion wing still. Oh my lord! How much do oh, might he can't have much left. Come on. He's got to only have a few left, or, or none, because he's used quite a few, and we've wish and protect each time, because he's been doing like two, two, uh, two living wings each for each wish and protect. We've used like six wishes and protects, so yeah, should easily be out of PP. Bite's no longer the table, which means we can go for the bite again. Snarl goes off, doing nothing. We have hyper potions as well. I could use, but I like wish and protect a bit more. Bite is, yeah, doing little to nothing, but that's all we got, guys. We're out of PP soon, actually. Dark Pulse again. I'll see if I've got an X attack, actually, because then obviously it's going to boost my attack. Flinched. Ah, oh, of course, Dark Pulse flinch. Uh, battle items, that's what I want. Uh, X accuracy and dire hit. Dire hits for critical hits, but I don't want to do that in case I get the critical hit when it's at low health. And then that'd be like, oh shit, damn. <laughs> Snarl again, which is I'm fine with. He's still got the Sable, so that could fuck us over again, but who knows. Bite goes off. Yep. Two or three more of those, I think. Dark Pulse again. Please don't flinch me. Napion's cool, too cool for flinch. Yeah, he's too cool for flinch. I'm going for, for another Wish and Protect, though, because we're going to get low health soon. Disable is going to save my bite, which I'm fine with, because I'm not actually... Well, I'm not fine with it, but it's all right, because I'm not using it right now. So, go for the Wish. Then we'll go for the Protect. 
He's, if, if he's used a bling wing, Oblivion Wing now, we'll be fine with that. Nope, can you start for a second? I think he's officially run out of PP for Oblivion Wing, which is nice. Can't use Bite still. Because it's disabled. So I guess I have to give her a Wish or a Protect. But, or just use an item. But I don't want to do that. Actually, okay. Fine, I'll go for the Battle Items. And I'll use an X Accuracy for no reason whatsoever, since all our moves are full accuracy anyway. <laughs> just the fact that we want to... Yeah. Oh, I still didn't run out of the stable. Okay, I guess I'll use something. Four store leopard berry. See we could use that to get PP back on um Lash Resort, but obviously he's just low enough health already. So Stash Restore. Person berry, land berry, aspect berry. Okay, that you know what I'll do. I'm just gonna use hyper potion on Godzilla, even though we don't need it. Um I just need to use this to stall out the time. Okay, hopefully the disable is going to wear off this time. Yes, no longer disabled. Okay, thank you. Biting time again. Dark Pulse again. Please don't flinch. Please no flinch. There we are, thank you. Bite again. Okay, I'm not, I don't want to risk another one. I'm going to I'm gonna have to capture now, guys. Get them Pokeballs up. 26 on the left, we should be fine. Let's get this Evel tool in a Pokeball, guys. Let's do it. Stalling out as one as the match. One. Two. Always on the third one, isn't it? Okay, right. Disable. Disable my bite, feel free to. I'm not going to use it anymore, so. We're going to go for our Pokeballs. If he disabled the use of Pokeballs, he'd be like, say what now? <laughs> That'd be like, okay. Okay, let's do this. Ready? One. Two. Damn it, again. Snarl. Let's do it. Okay, um, we can take another attack. But I'm going to go for the Wish now. Because, you know, he could use Dark Pulse, which he is going to. And that's going to do more damage than Snarl. We're going to use Wish. Then we're going to go for Protect. And then we can go for some more captures. And now I could easily go for the Hyper Potions here, guys. But I want to be... I don't want to use Healing Items if I can use Healing Methods sort of thing in um, in battle. Because, you know, Healing Items are just really cheap. I could just get full health points every time I'm on low health sort of thing. Whereas the Wish and Protect are more strategic. Okay. Time for the Pokeball. Let's do it, guys. Let's do it. One. Two. Three. Yes! We got Eveltal, guys! Woohoo! Eveltal was caught. Gotcha! Yeah! Eveltal's day was added to the Pokedex. And there we are. The Destruction Pokemon. When its life comes to an end, it absorbs the living energy of every living thing and turns into a cocoon once more. Yeah, yeah. I'm not going to give it a nickname. We shall. It's been transferred to dead. Brilliant! <laughs> been transferred to dead. Um, uh, no, wait. I don't want to do that. I want to I wanna keep my pie. Yeah, don't want to eat Voltal. No, I don't. Ah! Just please, no, I. Just, okay, please, I don't want to. No. Yes, fine. Don't want to battle with you, Voltal. I want to battle my team. What a startling development. I know I already would have thought you were the, 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 the chosen one. <laughs> Serena's face again. <gasps> And here he is. So this is the mighty of Oto. I expected more from a Pokemon called a legend. You desire help from people? You need help from people? What's going on with that outfit? Is that really the Sandra? Oh, whatever. In to Beach, what are you doing here? For me, victory is using the ultimate weapon. In order to do that, I need to acclaim the legendary Pokemon's power and send it to the weapon once again. What the fuck's he got anyway? It's not explain what these are. What are they? Are they like things that are going to kill me? Or are they guns? Or are they sort of stuff that's going to help him win the match? I don't know. He's got a Mega Ring, which is obviously because Mega Gyarados. So yeah. Hello, Lissandra. Mien Shao, my mortal fucking enemy. <laughs> Godzilla, I think we have do we have full health points again? Or not? We'll, we'll see. When we we'll see when we switch out now. Because we are gonna switch out. <laughs> yeah, we do have full health points. Okay. Out the death petal it is, because death petal resists the fighting type moves, which is the reason I picked it. Um but hopefully it can resist them well though. Let's see. Out it comes. Sword stance, which is a problem. Hopefully it doesn't have... Fuck acrobatics. Fuck me, no. Shit, my life. Why did I do this? It's most likely faster. I don't think I can take it on one extra century, see? I believe there's a acrobatics coming, so I'm going to switch out to star. Star is the only one that can take them. Oh, I, I chose death petal fighting types, but then this Mien Shao is like the ultimate fighting type. Oh, at least it cancels my one thing. Intimidate's going to help out too. It's only on plus one attack now. Acrobatics, yep, indeed. Good thing I switched out, because otherwise that thing would have destroyed my death petal, and it would no longer be alive. Go for the spark. It's faster. Hydro kick comes off. It's probably going to kill us, to be honest. Actually, no, wait, yeah, it is. Damn it! 
Oh, this fucking Mien Xiao! I'm fed up with it! Literally! I'm gonna get Revi. Revi is our only chance of taking this thing out because it's faster and it's got uh, extra sensory. It's our only chance. I'm not sure if Death Pet will be faster. That's why I didn't want to go for um, extra sensory there. Extra sensory goes off. Please kill it. Please kill it. Thank you. So we lost Star to it, which is fucking annoying. But I could. I, there's nothing else I could do, guys. Nothing I could do at all. Maybe if I thought about switching to someone else instead of Death Pet in the first place, we could have won, but still. Nothing I could do in that situation. Right, so Pyro's come out. No idea fucking why. This guy is the worst switcher in the world. I'm going to go for a Surf. It's probably because, yeah, he's got Dark Pulse on this thing, but I'm going to change type anyway. This is why, yeah. Green just shits over everything in-game because they don't get Protean. <laughs> they don't they don't understand it. And out comes Hunchcrow. Okay. No idea what Hunchcrow came out. Uh, I can't really do anything to this thing apart from Smackdown, so I'm going to switch out. Go into Godzilla. Star. Ah! I like Star. Damn it. Oh well. Nothing else we could do. Me and Shao's a twat. Me and Shao is on the on the my most hated Pokemon list now. Same with Scrafty. Because they're always the ones that I lose Pokemon to. Okay, we'll go for the Ice Fang here. See how much damage we can get off. Powerful! Powerful Godzilla here. Swipe sweeping it. Swiping it out. Level 52 for Godzilla. The power is real. It's a, it's got calm nature too. Come on, it's a calm nature. It's reducing its attack. <laughs> Gyarados is here. Intimidate's going to affect me, which means I don't really want to stay in here. It's going to Mega Evolve and become a Water Dark type, so I can definitely send out someone to deal with that. So I'm going to send out Death Petal. If he goes for a Water type move as well, obviously that's going to be nice for me. So we'll see. I love the backgrounds of this battle too. It's all fiery and shit. Gyarados is going to Mega Evolve. Ooh. The power is real. And obviously now we can get super effective grass moves on this thing as well as nothing else. Mold Breaker, don't give a shit about that. Outrage, okay, we can take an Outrage, I'm pretty sure. It's powerful, but... Damn. Uh... Now I'm in a position where I can't do shit. We haven't got a, a Fiery type we can go out to either. We can go to Napion, maybe, who could probably just take an Outrage to the face. Um, I guess that's what we're going to have to do. Switch out Napion. I can't stand with Death Petal. Because I'm not sure, I'm pretty sure it's faster, but I'm not sure if a Giga Drain would give me enough health points to then survive another Outrage. So I go to Napion, which has to stall here with Wish and Protect, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, we, we're taking that stuff like a boss. Going to go for a Wish, he's going to attack again, and then he's going to get confused, which is nice. So Wish comes, Wish is real, shouldn't kill us, yep. There's the Confusion, which is nice, awesome. Going to go for the Wish myself, then they have to Protect, just to get over half health points. And then we shall see, shall we? Protecting up. Mold Breaker does not pass Protect. I thought for a second, does Mold Breaker pass Protect? Fuck, it does, I'm screwed. But no, it doesn't. Hurt itself, Confusion, which is nice. And I healed up. Might be worth going for another Wish, though. I don't know. Well, no, I'm I can take another attack, we know this. So I'm going to use a full Restore. Or well, no, not full Restore, Hyper Potion, rather. On Death Petal, because we need that Giga Drain. We also have Cradley we can go to, so yeah. Aqua Tail. You're gonna, get, you're gonna get stabbed from it, rather. So it's gonna. Ooh, okay. If we assume another Aqua Tail's coming, we've got a, a safe switch to Death Petal. So I'm gonna go to Death Petal here. I mean, De we know Death Petal can take an attack because it took the Outrage. Uh, it's just whether it's an Aqua Tail or not. Could this be nice? Aqua Tail, yeah, we can take an Aqua Tail. Better than the uh, Outrage because it's a lower base power. Yep, just half. And I definitely know a Giga Drain can get me enough health points to survive one of those. We are fast. Here comes the Giga Drain. Wiping it out. It's high special defense, this thing, so it's definitely going to survive. Um, outrage comes off, but we are faster, and I know we can take it out from those health points, so we should be good as long as we survive the Outrage, which we did last time, so we should this time. Yep, yeah, Poison Point Poison it as well! Not even bad. Uh, so we could just Poison Storm on Umbreon, but Umbreon's already on low health points, so... Just hit it with a nice clean Giga Drain. And that will be Gyarados finished! Good game, Roserade! This is why you're powerful! Power is real! Got some half points back, and Garrett is fainted. Yeah, yeah. Death Petal gets some experience. Napion gets some. Godzilla got some, and we defeated Team Flare boss Lissandra. Break your glasses. They should be. They should be broken. They shouldn't just be staying like. They should be cracked to, to like, like you know, symbolize his defeat. But no. Ha! I did it. <laughs> what the fuck? I just died. <laughs> that I can't. Why? That's a stupid position. He goes like this. Ugh. Wow. Yep, okay, we don't really give a shit. 
bum 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 bum. Serene's like, please, please no, please no. <laughs> okay. Okay, we, we didn't give a shit. There is enough to use at once. Hada! Matt, second most pupils, the other one is a flower that blooms to no avail, just like me. But this ends here. I will show you what its remaining power can do. Matt, Shauna, let's get out of here. And they run and just leave in there. All this thing does, though, is blow itself up. It doesn't actually do anything else. Flower penis uses ejaculation. <laughs> oh my god. They're taking it too far now. It goes to use it. Whoa! Tsh. All it does though is it kills itself. Watch out! Down it comes. And blows itself up. I don't know if this is Lissandra was what he wanted to do, or whether, you know, he wanted something else, but still. And there he goes. The flower penis is no more. Destroyed. With a huge hole in the ground. <laughs> oh god. There we are. Okay, it's nice nice cheery music again. It's collapsed in on itself. Phew, I'm so glad you're all safe. I really expect the courage and kindness you all you showed. Thank you, we're all fine. Are you go with all okay, Tiano? Yep, as you can see we're doing great. Thanks for asking. We worked together to save the Pokemon Connected the Stones on Route 10. I most, I most left bat, left battling with Team Flare to Sino and Sina and Dexia though. Who are the Sina, who are these Senior and Dexia you speak of? We're the masked heroes. Don't worry about it, Tiano. We're all doing the best we could do. We were all doing the best. Blah, blah, blah. We were all doing the best we could, we could to stop Team Flare's plan. Oh, we have a bit of news for you. We managed to destroy the machine in Los Angeles Lab that's spying on people's holocaster transmissions. So we don't have to deal with the Team Flare anymore. Now I can go back to figure out my Pokedex. It's all he cares about. It's all he cares about. We saved the world, but filling up my Pokedex is what it's all about. Thank you, Serena. Yes. Okay. It's good to know. Nice to know, etc. Does this huge hole stay here forever? I can't even remember. <gasps> it's easy. A long time. A long, long time ago. A very long time ago. The man made an ultimate weapon. Using it required the life force of many Pokemon. The Pokemon granted eternal life learned this. The resurrected eternal Pokemon left the man's side. The man was surprised and sad. He had revived it so they could be together. Day after day passed, but they were never to meet. Eventually, he became a mere shell of a man. A man condemned to wander forever by the light of the weapon. And a Pokemon that also wanders eternally. Where is it now? What do I have to do to meet it? Quick, 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 sad story, sad story. But yeah, does this huge hole stay here forever? I can't remember. I never go to GSN Town anymore, there's no need. <laughs> And this, this Team Flare's base is like blocked out now, I'm assuming. Yeah. Wow, it's destroyed, but it's just it's got flattened. Wow, okay. Weird. So we head to the Pokemon Center, and I guess we have to hatch an egg for Eveltal. Yeah. So let's get in there and choose this egg. Uh, yeah, we'll hear that first, just in case. Because I like to keep my Pokemon nice to healed. Obviously, Star needs to go in the dead box, unfortunately. Because of the stupid Mian Shao. My, my, uh, my arch enemy now. I don't know if I hit him more or less than Sc Scraggy and Scrafty. Hmm. Anyway, there's yeah. You take your battle there, and we shall put Star in here. Item take, and your battle. Yes, it's a dose on nature, so it's not even that good. <laughs> Sad face, but we'll get there. Da, 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 da. Put these guys in. So we need to. We lost Star, so we could put sh Bubbles on our team, the Pikachu. Or we could put something else. Depends what we hatch from Eveltal. Bubbles would be the nice choice because obviously we've got dark types, we've got water types, we've got grass types as well. So yeah, Bubbles would be the one unless this Pokemon we hatch is better. So I guess I'll get my random number generator and generate a number. Let's go, number. It's loading. It's not loading. Okay, number 238. So 30, 60, 90, 120, 150, 180, 210, 240. So this is 240 here, 239, 238. Let's take this, let's put that there. Goodbye, Evelto. Nice knowing you, you were a bitch to catch, but yeah. Okay, guys, so I'm going to go and catch this Pokemon, and I'll be back in just a second. Welcome back, guys, and the egg is just about to hatch, or it is, you know, hatching now, so I guess we'll go and hatch the egg. Have it in here, so let's get on with this. I wonder what's going to be. It could be interesting. No idea what's going to be. Nickname Nick doesn't offer any sort of approach to that or whatever, so I guess we'll just have to see. The egg is going to be a. It's a horsey. Okay, not even bad, not even bad. Horsey hatched from the egg. Woo. And the nickname for horsey is going to be Snaz. Snaz. 
Not the king as in <laughs> most of horses, so snaz. Ba -ba -ba, snaz. There we are. Not even bad. So I guess by the time it's level 50, it's almost a king draw, which is not even bad. Actually, wait. King draw's a evolution item, isn't it? Yeah. So it'll be, it could be a king draw if I, if I evolved it. Let's see. So I guess we'll put it in the PC. We already have a water type in the form of Greninja, but if it ever lose Greninja, we could always use Snaz instead, sort of thing. So let's pop Snaz down. What's it got? Adamant. It's got Sniper, which is awesome. Crucial hits for the win. Uh, and obviously it could be have Adamant Nature. I guess it's Kingdra Physical then? Wow, okay. Never knew that. Um, no, yeah, let's put it down here, just so I remember to level up and stuff. Okay, guys, so I think that's where we're going to end this episode off, because, you yeah, know, we did take a while catching in, uh, catching, uh, Evel 2, and also beating Lissandra and such. So, anyway, hopefully you guys, you guys enjoyed today's episode. If you did, don't forget to leave a like down below, and answer the question of the day in the comment section, and I guess I will see you next time, guys. Thanks for watching. Goodbye, my friends.